In 2010, FIFA scored a spectacular own goal when they announced the 2022 World Cup was to be held in Qatar. The bid was surrounded by allegations of bribery, with whistleblowers claiming millions of pounds and even knighthoods had been on offer to hand the Gulf state the event. FIFA deny all this, of course, but that hasn't stopped them taking a good kicking. Welcome to Qatar TV. Oi, 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 oi. Football is the beautiful game of money. Much money in the Premier League, much money for FIFA. We thank FIFA very much because we take 2022 World Cup. Money! Football is all about money. Football money. Money, money, money. Special money. We take the World Cup for 2022. Yeah. yeah you would cause... like to come to this? Um, no, no one's going to go to Qatar, to be honest with you. Why not? It's going to be too hot. Um, like, you can't play football in hot weather, can you? I'm camels. I do not care in camels, my friend. I do it in money. How has money ruined football? Because it's made countries like Qatar come from nowhere and suddenly have a... What do you say about my country? <laughs> John Terry is... Yeah, he's the best as well. John Berry is a very bad man, though. If in Qatar he uh, Nick one up with another man's wife, we would have to chop off his hand. Fair enough. He's still got his feet. No, it's and will you come to the World Cup 2022? Definitely. I'm but here. you're not allowed to bring any of your gay friends or any women, okay? I'll leave that to you, mate.